Thanks for messing around. Vampire Survivors Beswick 350. We are trying to unlock Harry Fernandez, which requires fully evolving the Custodes glyphs. Custodes glyphs, which are apparently what Cornell does. So I'll start with him and see if I can get that third one to evolve it. He is the protagonist of Castlevania 64, Legacy of Darkness, the re release of Castlevania 64. 23,600. Huh. Oh, I can start with either one head. Well, this one's faster. All right, he is a man beast, not to be confused with a werewolf. Totally separate things. He has his own music track. And I really want to. I mean, I don't think anything actually buffs up the head anyway. I think it's actually really bad in that way. You know, maybe duration. I don't want to keep going Bolero every single time. Yeah, the evolution is the three heads, so I presume he gets the third head by default at some point. I didn't check his thing. Oh, right, he changes into something else when he evolves. Oh, this is a Bloody Te Tears remake. It's odd. Not uh, Belmont. Nice he hid. Wow, sure would be nice to actually hit anything. And there's the central. This Custos summons Kerberos, his eventual head, boosts armor, recovery, and cooldown when damaged. Good grief. That's uh, super good. So those are going to all combine into one. Uh, they probably don't need anything else. What do I want for my other weapons? Well, it said armor recovery. Something else, so let's build into that a bit. Uh, let's get weapons that won't evolve. Aura Blast. That's kind of like it. We'll move with that. Hmm. No soul steal. They'll steal your soul. Oh, I didn't proc it, something. Armor. That's what well, kind of need it, honestly. Oh man, what was the third one? It's probably damage, so spinach. I don't even know if it gets the benefit of. Uh, thing. Let's heal up. It's a soul steel is really good. And I got Sarag statue boofing on me up too. Oh man, it just it's out constantly. It's like garlic. Neat. And if I get hit, it boosts up better. Spin and just grab that. Alright, get them maxed out, because they're definitely going to be a combiner. Spinage! Alright, now I can grab the tier Jisoo. Oh, that the heads always just fire out in the same, wherever you're facing. Still faster. Still faster coming this way. Alright, obviously I'm gonna still grab Rapidus to you. Uh, hmm. Well, you're close to maxing out. Wait, do you have... Okay, no, you just haven't shown back up. I haven't seen you, so... Don't, don't, don't. Get that funky remix going. Nah, it's pretty far off to get without the Dio. Or Sonic Dash, at least. We'll actually grab the wings here first, because... Well, I think that's actually the best option. Well, Crown is actually the best option, but I don't want Crown. Okay, so you up 10%. Not a lot, eh? Munchy munch. Okay, so I guess area is how many times he goes chompy chomp. Not based on duration, for whatever reason. Well, maybe it's based on a combination of it. Arma, 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 dio. Let's go get Parmages while we're here. Oh, somewhat helpless. Well, very early on you is more helpful because you're big. There's a garlic that actually... And it does more damage. It's really weird. Cooldown reduced by one second. Base damage up by four. More than Garak, actually. Get a little bit of area now. Probably. Completely better. 
And I got Soul Steel on the back end. Soul! Oh yeah, I got a comment that Julie is the one who has to unlock the innocent soul for one of the unlocks. I don't really get it, but A. First, two familiars, which I'm not sure how that's happening. Oh, well, of course I know how that's happening. Well, like... Hmm, how to say it? Oh, wow, you went down really fast. So for characters that I need to replay to unlock, I'll do that is effectively one of their second waves. I should just do the second wave. Well, I don't know how it's going to go out. Well, I know how it's going to go out. It's going to be Mad Force and, and Inlay Library. Still far off. Maybe be using a Soul Steel. Vacuum will help, though. That cooldown down. Base area up 10, damage up by 4. Cooldown erased by a second, base area up, damage up again. Cooldown max. Base area up 10. Base area up 10. But the head is still quite tiny. Oh, hey. Base area up by 20%, cooldown reduced by 0.1 second. Damages definitely felt better. And that is an evolution chest, so I should stick around. Do I have the duplicator? Yeah, I do. Uh, armor. No, spinning would have been better there. Still, I'm going to take a lot of damage, so... More levels. That bit of red gem there. Here you up. Damage up. Yeah, I can definitely feel the beginning really popping off there. Really? As soon as I need it, it never shows. I grabbed the one on the map, but I don't want to do that. Gosh. Well, Soul Steel's finally got its cooldown reduced enough that's actually gonna happen. That's good. Oh man, that would have been great on Saint Germain, wouldn't it? Get that cooldown reduction maxed out. Alright, let's get you together. Ooh, and it's a big chest. Let's let it ride. Da da da. -da. Custodum, you need have Dexter Custos, Sensor Custos, and Centralist Custos. Okay, just fires them out endlessly and then they spew fire. Oh, that's great. Oh, there's an idea. I should have done way before. Well, you'll just auto evolve. Whoa. Vastly different performance compared to its predecessor. Sure, let's get an RPG. Man beasts and rocket launchers. Can you ever think of a more poignant combination? A lot of fire. I don't think it gets the benefit of Heart of Fire, but that would be insane if it did. Quite a long ways to go. Alright, let's get Sonic Dash so we can get through here faster. Soul Steel, of course, is still great to pick up. Wow, did it just activate three times? Maybe because of Duplicator? No, that would be weird. I mean, it's something that shouldn't be affected by Duplicator at all. Or heck, most things. Right, let's get rid of Gold Ring while we're here. Frying out the 
cross thing. Is that from the Union? Fun. Attacks fast. Damage isn't so great, but hey. The silver ringing. I don't think I particularly care. Man, those projectiles are slow. I might actually want speed. Oh, well, just to confirm, let's make sure, yes, it is just those three, nothing else, passive. Wise. Hmm. Do them. Of course, beginning plus stupidator means I get a lot. Imp. Better fly. A bitter, bitter fly. The well, duplicator fires out. Maybe it's duration actually for how long they spew out the fireballs when the fireballs are now duplicator. Well, uh, do I tested? I got three armadillos left. What do I want to pull from them? I already have what I need for hand grenade here. What else? Well, I can test out the duration with Corona's box and Spellbinder and box is helpful. Or did what else for killing power? Oh, right, Bracer. Well, let's get it faster because right now it's so slow. The fire blasts are slow. Wait, maybe the cross thing what happens if you evolve your main weapon. I don't care about this. I'll grab you here, though. I'm not getting a lot of XP. or kills, frankly. Oh yeah, my stats probably got boosted too, didn't they? Wow, 4.9 recovery. 6.5 cooldown reduction. That's a big... Yeah, shut up. Oh yeah, and getting the boots up will help too. Even like no XP. Did my growth go down? No. Even higher than normal. Why does everyone have such high growth? I mean, for this map. I just didn't notice it before. God, is it? 29 armor, Jesus. I wonder I'm not taking any damage. Okay, I can just spawn every boss I want. That's gonna hurt me. I'm not gonna do anything for damage without a divine bloodline, but hey, who cares? It hurts me. No oh, armadillos. Down low. Way down low. Alrighty. Bonus box. Let's go fast with some Sonic Dash. Oh man, I forgot the bit. Castlevania Legacy of Darkness. Proving that no, remix and remastering what you just put out has been a time-honored tradition for forever. Say hi to Fire Emblem 3, which is just Fire Emblem 1 with a new coat of paint and a little bit more story added on at the end. Well, okay, a lot of story added on at the end. And then they re-release it again and again. Go figure, eh? And then two. Oh wow, you still do damage. Not a lot, mind you, but still. And I have high recovery. Grab that treasure chest. Whatever red gem I was gonna get, it's gonna be huge when it happens. I've killed like 50,000 enemies. Oh, this dang thing. Why is this keep happening? I know how it's happening, but why? How it's happening is whenever I go into a overhang or something that has a roof over it, it happens. Why does it keep happening when I go into something with a roof over it, though, is the question to me. Oh, right. I could have just poured it over. Hey, bugbear. You bugging any bears? Oh, no, Mercer. 
Let's get fasting. Who the heck are you? You must be from one of Soma's games. You have definitely got that look about you. And I just need the chest for the stuff in them at this point. At least Frozen Shades are nothing. I don't care about spellbooks. I just want to keep things minimal so I don't have a billion things all lined up. Oh, wow. There we go. This is a level up storm like little else. Yeah, there's nothing there I want. Hey, let's get Kaforde out of here. Or Kaforde dead right there. Espionage! It really does not want to give me. Yeah, it's not nearly as many levels as I was hoping for. Man, it did not want to give me anything I wanted. Da -da -da. A speed break? No, not even close. Definitely want Spellbinder to help out with making sure. Wait, what? Oh, it's down low. I basically never don't speed break this, so I don't know exactly where I'm going. And this is Shin Bull on full dead, right? Next nearby enemies, speed effects damage. Movement speed, attack speed. Those can be the same thing. Hey, Arcana. Ooh, double fire. Oh man, double fire stole steel. You aren't dying with that. Oh, like, could have actually speed broken now. Okay, here we go. Yeah, there we go. Quite some big hits. Even the fire from Sarg's statue is getting quite large. Man, Galamoth looks so tiny. He was in Legion's room. He filled it to the bottom. Oh, I'm dead. Yeah, you drop anything good? Yay. Silver, silver, silver ring. Oh wait, don't I? I'll probably need to get like 10,000 kill or X amount of kills with the central one before it unlocks for default, won't I? Yeah. Yeah, well, that's for off camera. Yes, let's do that. I have no idea what the second wave even looks like it at this point anymore. Yep. Go up. Go, 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 Galamar. There's a chest around there. I presume whoever starts with the glyphs, for some reason, isn't Shonoa. Is the one who unlocks the final one. In fact, I'm pretty sure I read that. All buzz. The t t Torona. T t Torona box. Hi, Galamoth. I'll see you around one day. Nope, you're not getting in. Get away. Get away, Atlantean. Are you dead? It's hard to tell. Well, let's go get my next armadillo. Oh, it's the better fly. Damage isn't actually very good. 
and ka ka karama's mana. What do you need in life but more karama's mana? I think there's a rock drop the bone. I'm not the only one confused at that, right? More enemies means more XP. Wow, that was not a high good amount of levels considering how long I'd gone. Oh, well, my damage has gotten considerably better. Yep. It does not look like duration affects this. Or does it? I think there's two effects going off with here. Sometimes the head bites, and the other times it sends out the fire. Interesting, interesting. Hey, it's an Orlo again. Wait, oh, Orox is deep down. I have to get all the way over here. Welcome back, Count Two. And this guy. You even hurt me. I don't think you can actually hurt me through my armor and the health or gen. That's not even the max health or gen I'm gonna get to. I don't want to affect you. Wait, I thought it was the Jingxi that dropped it. Oops. Oh, that's not good for my damage. Or my killing rate. I mean, it's fine damage, and I'm kind of invincible. But er, don't be thinking I can do that much damage. And our curse is a lot. But on the other hand, her enemies is a lot. Probably would be best to grab Corona's mana first. Just more enemies. And retreat back to the start. Yeah, I don't think I can actually die here till death shows up. A minutes in already, huh? And once more, I actually messed around with my settings. But did you know that CapCut doesn't allow you to set videos to 60 frames per second? It will lie to your face and say it does, but they won't upload at 60 frames per second. I tried multiple times. I messed with all the settings that changed to 60 FPS. None of them worked. And then YouTube lied to my face that it worked. Weird. Volcafo, daddy. Everything first. Yeah, I don't think duration is affecting the Kerberos heads at all. Well, you have to try it out. You don't try something out, and you'll never know if it works or not. Know, something sent for like 300. Don't know what that is. Yay, I can repeat a spew. It is still going to be fast just to teleport up. Especially because I need to go get the Metaglio here. Yes, I would like... 7 health regen. Oops. I have to move Pi at some point. Down, 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 baby. Post the Navy. Come on, la la, coco pop. Shimmy, shimmy, run. I have no idea what I just said. I mean, that's sort of me by the default, right? I have no idea what's going on. I am very confused. Bye-bye, everything. Wow, you did damage. Very impressive, Atlantean. Very impressive. But can you stand against Cornell? Hmm. I need to recheck something. 
At least he has one name. That'll make the tags much better. Melio Carfordi. Speed affects cooldown and damage. It's really hard to see when it's actually doing anything, but the sword does a tremendous damage for the full score screen. So it's doing work. Just never gonna notice it. Or, there it is. More boss, more. I think I might be the one that's doing that 400. Reduce that cooldown. Wow, the rocks are so fast. Oh, why do any of that when I could just go over here? Fight the creature. I presume it's the creature here anyway. I think something died. Dang, Atlantean. So healthy. Oh, hey, there's my Rapita Steel. Or Rapita Steel. Why isn't it Dio? I ain't bread. Yeah, I think here's finally my big level up. I've been waiting on you for so long. I mean, it does a big statue. Oh, man, I can see the... Uh, well, for anyone new, my this is recorded on console, and the TV and the computer screen are not aligned. They're at right angles to one another. And I can see out of the corner of the eye when I'm doing this circle jerking. And oh boy, is OBS not liking it. It is so flashy. Dun -dun. Art! You are art. I am art. We are all art. You can be art too if you put your mind to it. But I don't want a bone. Fails. Fails always fails. Get rid of everything on screen. We got rid of the Parmagus there. Dang, they get durable. Not even that much curse going on either. Just Farog, Farog, Sparog. No, I am no dog. I'm a man beast. Totally different things. Totally different things. Man, wait, does that actually give XP? Oh, right. Speaking of XP, why do I not have the other armor deal done? Wait, did the music track switch? Brown. Okay, yeah, it definitely does XP. What was I thinking? So much healing. Soul Steel is fairly insane. As you'd expect from that. I mean, it kills everything. Why does it have new damage? Oh, I guess for regular things like the Atlantean here. Wow, my upfront damage is actually terrible. Bomb. You aren't hurting me, which is nice. Oh, there we go. No! But Soul Steel saves the day. It goes off multiple times for sure. I think the cross act, or whatever's popping off the cross, I have to presume it's Aura Blast. Whatever's popping it off is causing. Well. I don't know what turns it into the cross. Usually just a weird blast. I mean, it's like the side effect of one of the tips, whip tips. 
then put into a full weapon. Oh, level up storm. Richter, I think. I think I... Mm. So hard to tell. You can't do anything. I'm too fast for you. Yeesh. 10k this on. That seemed pretty decent well, compared to a lot of the nonsense that's been going on. Uh, decent isn't wanted. I need astounding. I want to keep up. But I didn't really have any arcana that really affected my thing. <laughs> that affects three of my weapons, but not the head that shoots fire. Actually, isn't this kind of incredible for Sarag statue? If you get it big enough. RPG in. Like, I did a lot here to boost up the heads, too. I'm fine with sitting here. I got eight minutes to spare. Anyway, so I've tried multiple times with cap cut. Try and get an actual 60 video, 60 FPS video out of it. But no, it was always 30 frames per second. I set the base to 30. Set the output to 60. 30. I set the base to 60. The output to 30. 30. I set the base to 60. And the output to 60. 30. And yes, the video itself was 60 frames per second. And I uploaded it to YouTube just to make sure, because then I could do second by second, or frame by frame. And it was 60. That was strangely the live version. The stream version of it wasn't. Very peculiar on that foot. Also got... Man, just endless soul steal. You'll win for sure with that. Oh no, wait. The noise is the cross blast firing off. Presume is your blast. I'm not sure what else it would be. Let's get you out of the pool so I can just mash a. Get my health regeneration up even higher. Alright, and I'll end at 9.3. If I had Saravanda, I'd be basically unkillable. Oh, wait, no, Heart... I wasn't even with Heart Refresh. I have 14.3 with Heart Refresh. Jeez. Oh, right, I also had to do whatever that moon thing is to unlock Man Beast... Well, Megalo Cornell. Uh, where is that going to be at? Where are you, Moon? Ooh, up here. I think you're probably over here. Oh, that 3DMI. Oh, the moon hasn't changed. It's still fall here. Odd. Oh, no, there it is. There's Crescent. It's not blue, though. I have to make it blue. Am I making that up? I can't remember. No, oh, it's hard to tell sometimes. Heck, it's hard to tell all the times. But this should unlock Carrie Fernandez. One of the base characters from Castle 64. Castlevania 64. Henry and Cornell here were added on in Legacy of Darkness. What? There's the moon still. Huh. Weird sound effect coming out. Hey, Karasu man. I think your name ended up being changed to something. I'm just going to keep calling you Karasu man. Whatever it got changed to is not 
as simple to say as Legion. I don't care for you, Egg. The man beast needs nothing. Nothing but his claws and his carburous heads. Man, those are lasting forever. Oh wow, well, I have a hit limit on them too. Okay, maybe not so long. I mean, they are getting in. Doesn't matter that they're getting in between my armor, health, or generation. I'm not sure anything can kill me shortly of lengthening and death. I if I just said I'm one of the toughest bosses. Alright, Carrie's next, and then whoever's after Carrie should be good already. Put the RPG on the low. The Kerberos head will take care of the right. The R Blast will take care of the north. And the Melio and for Dorte. That's not even remotely right, but I'm going to keep saying it like that. And then a billion other ways, because who wants to pronounce things correctly? Anyway, Cornell goes and fights his man beast friend. Who's not one of these, I think. Probably. Then fights Dracula. Probably. And rescues Henry. Hey, no he doesn't. No, he doesn't fight Dracula. That's... And Henry goes and saves the children, and Carrie also saves the children, and... Reinhardt saves a woman. Then someone beats Dracula. Henry actually fight Dracula? Is he just like a... punk? Oh. It's so weird to unlock him before. Cornell. Uh, maybe I'm just misremembering. Maybe a Reinhardt or Carrie has to be the one to rescue the children. The child. We will all rescue the children one day. One day we'll rescue the children. Blah, 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 vampire survivors. Two minutes. Two minutes to victory. Then what else? Next is carry then. Yoko, maybe. And some more spellbooks, I think. We'll have requirements that I might have to do off camera. We'll probably have to do off camera and look up. Just to get them going. At least I hope this unlocks carry. Boy, would it. Well, hope it unlocks carry. It's like Custodes Glyphs, right? It's the only thing that says Custodes. Otherwise, I'm in for a very long chain of trying to look up what the heck goes on. I mean, those are Glyphs too, the Dominus, but they're also called Dominus. I think that would be a some other guy from Order of Ecclesia. Oh yeah, that founder of the Order of Ecclesia thing. It was probably the main villain, even though I don't didn't play that game. Because, well, I don't think there's a secret society formed to fight evil guy thing that doesn't have the guild master or whatever not be evil and in cahoots with the bad guy. I mean, that's just what happened in Devil May Cry. Two. Well, four. But as well. Probably something else. Definitely something else I've just forgotten. In my olden age, I'm older than Castlevania, some might say. Hey, that, Dracula. Alright, man beast is manned up and beasted out. Uh, not remotely as high as old Julia did. The innocent soul has won. Go stay. Quitting time. Yeah, there's Carrie. And, oh, yeah. Unlock the center one. Didn't evolve his weapon. How many kills do I have to get then? 
or didn't get Megalo him. RPG, wow. Uh, let's see, the Trinum Custodum, 8.6, worse than Megalo, barely better than Rapidus Fio. Heart of Fire was doing its best, guys. Soul Steel, it's really more just because of how slow it fires. The other two barely didn't get to do a thing. Oh, that's Cornell done. Carry officially unlocked. Uh, oh, I do have him unlocked. Blue Crescent Moon, it just... I'm all oh, right. It was a secret, not an unlock. That's what. But next up is going to be Kerry Fernandez once I get back around to start. And then Yoko. And then trying to find Ronaldo. Wait, I actually have that person. I just haven't bought them. But till next time, thanks for watching. All right. And Cornell has successfully completed what we needed him to. Sorry. Which is unlock Kerry and his. Man, beast self, blue moon crescent self. What a mouthful to say that. All right, that's 113 characters, 1,983 down, 729 to go. Oh God, it's still so much more. Next time up, it's going to be Carrie Fernandez. Thanks for watching. I hope you had some fun. On the right here, you can start the bezel from the start. On the left is the next video or the best video. And please subscribe in the middle if you haven't. Thank you anyone who has liked, disliked, commented, or subscribed. The support keeps me going. And have a good day, everyone, and keep messing around in the Vampire Survivors Beswick.